The Central European country of Austria is home to a population of just over 8 million people. Its history is rooted in Christianity, and indeed, it is predominantly a Catholic country. Figures, however, are putting the growing Islamic population at just over half a million since 2010. And with this figure continuing to grow, it raises the question, what's the appeal of Islam in a Central European country whose main religion is Christianity? We see that people have a spiritual longing that they feel there is something missing in their lives. If there is no dimension, no horizon as to the hereafter or where am I, why am I here? Ms. Bagayati represents a growing number of people worldwide who are finding comfort in the teachings of Islam, leaving behind the world they are familiar with. Many have stated that they are disillusioned and indeed abuse scandals in the Catholic Church has played a major part in the exodus of members. So admits Austrian Catholic Church press speaker Michael Pruller that the church will be smaller in membership and it will be smaller in social influence. Um, but I think this, is, this only highlights the kind of transformation the church is, is undergoing at the moment, um, being the great authoritative um, social institution which more or less has been forced upon the people for centuries. While the UN has expressed concern recently about growing acts of discrimination and violence against religious groups, Ms. Bagayati says this is the perfect time for Islam to show its peaceful nature even more. When I stepped to Islam, I had the personal impression that it's not something like a big change to me, but more like a step forward. This is why I feel that there is a good possibility to build more bridges between people because we share much more than many people would think. Each person's journey toward Islam is different, we're told, but whatever the story, they appear to echo a similar end. Solitude in finding a place and a way of life they can call home. Islam has unfortunately had the picture painted of fundamentalism by Western culture. But as time marches on, it appears to be taking that idea with it and turning it on its head. The number of converts continues to grow and according to projections, those numbers won't be slowing down anytime soon. Fabian Peer, Press TV, Vienna.